guys to write yourself? Um, a lot of things. I mean, you know, your everyday stuff like love and hate and all that combined and where we come from. How did you meet Um, uh, we met after high school. Well, we met in high school, but we formed after, like right after. Where are you guys from? Uh, Whittier. It's like a suburb of LA. I was playing with a band like Panic at the Disco, like increased your fan base. Um, yeah, to some extent. It's increased our fan base to a certain um, percentage of people. I mean, they have different fan bases. Are you guys involved in any charities or anything like that? Um, we've played for charities before, but involved in some, not really. How do you get your music out there? Like, uh, the internet. <laughs> like Facebook or MySpace? Or yeah, yeah. I mean, of course, we live in a you know modern time where um, yeah, the web really helps bands. So. What are their Oh, man, so many. Um, well, before Panic, we were on tour in the UK uh, with this band called Kitten and Tribes. Before that, we were on tour with the Deftones. I mean, we played with, you know, people from like 50 Cent to, I don't even know. I saw you guys change your label recently. What was the reason for that? Um, we got a better offer. What has been the hardest part of breaking into the industry? Uh, just getting used to the rules, I guess. You know, understanding the business aspect of it. What reactions have you gotten since you released your latest album? Uh, good ones. You know, it's been so long since we've released it, I mean, since we've recorded it to releasing it, so we were kind of, I don't know, our minds were in a different place when we finally released it, so the, the reaction was pretty good. What's your favorite song off the album and why? Um, probably the last one, just because it shows what step we're taking for the next one. You said you were from Whittier, so it's kind of a small town. How did you go about breaking out of the small town shell? Um, well, when we started out, there was like kind of a small town uh, like party scene going on. So we used that as kind of our ladder to get to start playing gigs. And then once that died out, we started playing um, like venues and things like that. So it was just like a rise. I mean, we're so close to LA, it's easy to play venues. All right. And what have been kind of some things that you Want, where, like where you want to go with your music? Are there any artists that you'd love to play a show with? Any venues that you really want to play a show with? It's kind of ridiculous, but there's this venue that I went to in the very beginning called the Glass House. It's not a big venue at all. Um, it's in Pomona, and I, I really just want to play there. Um, Artist-wise, uh, where is there a UK band? Okay, and what was it like getting to play overseas? Um, the first time was amazing. I mean, like, we didn't know what to expect, and it was all kind of new. We've played there so many times now that it just feels